guys, Gia Brewer here, and I'm here with a new video. And in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get Fortnite for Android on basically any Android device. So, as you guys know, as I'm recording this video, Fortnite for Android isn't out yet. As I, as you can see, I'm going to search up Fortnite, uh, Fortnite, not Fortnite, Fortnite, and of course, there's no Fortnite yet. So... Basically, I'm going to show you guys in this video how to sign up for the beta for Fortnite on Android. So, I'm going to show you guys something. So, I'm going to show you guys an example. I'm going to go to Minecraft, and I'm going to find it. And see, you are beta tester for this app. Awesome. When you scroll down, you'll see this. You're a beta tester. Apps like this give you the option to beta test for them. So, I'm going to click Learn More. And it's going to open up inside of here. So this is what you guys gotta do. When you're test, trying to test an app, well, you have to go to this website, play.google.com slash apps slash testing. Now, for example, I'm gonna type in minecraft.com.mojang.minecraft.pe. And this is gonna show, welcome to the testing program. Basically, for every app in the Google Play Store, they're, the developer has an option to do a couple of things. They can do a public beta, which is what Minecraft is. You can, anybody, developers, beta testers, anybody, can go and sign up for the beta, and they can get beta updates when the, before the official one is available. So, as you guys can see, I, ha I have the, test, the uh, beta testing page. This is for Minecraft. So, I'm going to go to a new page. So, I'm going to go to a new page that I have over here. And as you guys can see, this is App ID, basically, App ID Finder, pretty much. So the app ID is basically what's in here. The app ID for Minecraft Pocket Edition is com.mojang.minecraft.pe. Basically on Android, that is how uh, bundle identifi identification identifiers are on Android. So it's com.mojang.minecraft.pe. Now my phone has root, and I'm gonna show you guys what I mean. I'm gonna go to data data, and every single app is sorted by bundle ID. For instance, I'm going to go to Pixgun 3D, or I'm going to find it real quickly. Uh, com.p, we find it, um, I passed it, okay. Com.pixelgun3d, this is another app I play. Basically, com.pixelgun3d is the bundle ID for Pixgun 3D. Now that's how this is on Android and iOS. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to this bundle ID finder, and I'm going to type in Pixel Gun 3D. Now I'm going to press search. And you can do things like the all these stores or whatever. Now as you guys will be able to see, Pixel Gun 3D will be Zombie Gun 3D. So on iOS, the Pixel Gun 3D bundle ID is Zombie Gun 3D. So it's, on di it's different for iOS and Android. But in some cases, like I'm going to scroll down, this Block Gun Pixel War 3D is the same as it is on Android. Com.wizardgames.bg3ggo. Now, I'm going to scroll down. As you guys can see, they're even Pixel Strike 3D. Com.pixellabs.pixelstrike 3D. It's going to be com.name.name. So that's how it is most of the time on, An on iOS. So this is basically searching up the bundle ID for iOS. Now, what we can do is we can type in Fortnite, and it will come up with the Fortnite ID for iOS. See what I mean? This is the iTunes URL for iOS. I'm going to go to it. As you can see, this is the App Store, and this is what it looks like on the App Store. So I'm going to go back to the App ID Finder. And as you can see right here, com.chairentertainment.fortnite. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to copy that, because that is the bundle ID for Fortnite. Now, this is only a guess based on what the iOS version is. So don't take, don't, this may or may not work in the future. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back to the testing page and keep in mind all these links will be in the description down below. I'm going to type in testing. I'm going to type in this link right here. And then at the end, I'm going to paste the bundle ID at the end. Now it says not available. So that means that the developers did not put it inside the Google Play Store yet, or it's on a private beta right now. So if the developers were to, or if Epic Games 
were to make it a beta, they would put it through this, and people would get it through this website. And if or when they do release Fortnite for Android, this is what you would have to do to sign up for a beta, or if it is not a beta and they just try to release it, then it'll be like this. It'll be play.google.com play slash store, app details, and the same bundle ID at the very bottom. Because like I said, every Android application is different depending on its Android application ID. So as you can see right now, it is not up yet. After, this, after I record and upload this video, maybe it will be up. Maybe at some point after this video is up, it will be on the Google Play Store. Maybe when it's, when it's up, it has a completely different bundle ID. This is all my guess, pretty much, depending on the information I have. I don't work at Epic Games. I don't, I'm not a bad tester, or even though I wish I was. I'm not a developer. This is all I'm doing based on my Android and iOS info that I currently know in my head. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, make sure to smack that like button and subscribe for more Fortnite and Pixcon 3D videos. If you guys did, make sure to smack that like button with your nose like this. And see you guys next time. Bye.